so we have now found that we should perhaps model this we should model a second order factor model as well so what the first thing that i would do is i will save this as now i will give another name and i will call it as lead second order right so this is my next model and i see that there is a new file new amos file that has been created so we will delete these arrows now okay these and what i am going to do is i am going to now create a second order factor model second order factor i will call it as i will give it a name lead okay i call it as lead and then i draw paths from lead to the three first order as if these were my three indicators so just like emp has three indicators and we have drawn unidirectional paths similarly from lead we are going to draw these three paths to these three first order factors and then any one of these right has to be constrained to one right so we know that so let us constrain so i'm going to double click or you can right click and call object properties or double click on this arrow and give it a regression weight of one so this one of the paths right one of the paths has to be constrained to one we have seen this already right and i will beautify this and then you need to do one more one more thing just like for each item you needed a error similarly once you connect lead to these first order factors you will need to add the error term right so we add this error here here and here just like we had these are called as these will be structural errors because structural errors are between latent factor to latent factor even though they are in measurement model but we will call this as structural errors because emp is now going to be determined by leadership so there has to be an a residual term that should be modeled here right so that is the reason why this is this is done so to these error terms now with these error terms we will add we or we can give it a name so we had error name sir, sir could you just uh, sorry to interrupt sir could you just uh, clarify how to add the this thing on name right click on this error and i will give it a name what is the variable name i call it as e11 i will reduce its size i will call it as e12 and i will call this as e let me change the right so e13 uh, so why not e10 this time 